Personal finance decision test number one and two. We're doing a mean and median. The mean of a group of numbers was the traditional definition of average. Add them all up and divide by how many? So in this case, we have those six numbers. We add them all up. What do we get? 37 plus 7 plus 45 plus 11 plus 26 plus 24, 150. There were six of them. So we get to 25. For the second problem, median was the different kind of version of what is typical of a group. It ignores the highest and lowest extremes, thinking that those probably are biased and not representative of all of the numbers. To find the median, you had to list things in order and pick the central one or central two. And if there's two in the middle, then you have to take the mean of those. So first we put our list in order, 7, 11, 24, 26, 37, 45. Then let's work our way towards the middle. There's two in the middle this time. So we're going to take the mean of those, add them together and then divide by 2. So 50 divided by 2 is again 25. It worked out the same.